today we're going to learn how to tie the full Windsor. The full Windsor knot is a bold knot that's great for the larger proportion man who wants to balance a spread collar. The key characteristics of a full Windsor are, number one, it's a relatively large knot, and this is great for larger men. Number two, it's symmetrical in shape, therefore more formal by nature. Number three, it works best with a spread or cutaway collar. Start by draping the tie over your neck, adjusting it until the wide end is longer than the narrow end. Because this knot uses more of the tie fabric, you will need to start with the narrow end higher than with most other knots. Now first cross the wide end of the tie over the narrow end and then bring it under and through the neck opening. Next, cross the wide end behind the narrow end, then bring it through the neck opening again, this time going over. Cross the wide end across the front and bring it under and through the neck opening once more. Now pull the wide end of the knot through the loop formed in the front. Tighten the knot by pulling on the wide end while holding the knot until you're satisfied with the look. Bring the knot up to your neck by holding the narrow end while pushing the knot up with your other hand. Keep your tie looking tidy by putting the narrow end through the keeper loop on the back of the tie. Your tie should rest between the top and middle of your belt line. If it's too short, start over, make the narrow end higher. If it's too long, start with the narrow end a bit lower. Be sure to check out our full Windsor Knot infographic for a detailed step-by-step -step overview. And if you want more information on men's style, grab our free RMRS men's style app where I teach you how to tie 17 other necktie knots along with hundreds of other men's style tips. Make sure to like this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and let me know in the comments what you thought of this video.